Thank you, Travis. Good evening, everyone. My name is Dan Rayfield. I'm running to become Oregon's next Attorney General. Uh, Oregon's facing a really unique set of challenges right now, from housing and homelessness to the addiction crisis that's uh, sweeping across our every community um, in this state. We also have a lot of unprecedented opportunities here in the state as well. I'm running to become Oregon's next Attorney General because I believe the Attorney General, the Department of Justice, with the right leadership, leadership that I will bring to the office, that the Department of Justice, the Attorney General, can be an indispensable partner to solve our community's greatest challenges. What I bring to this office is 18 years as a practicing attorney representing individuals against corporations, large companies, and others in pursuit of helping those folks when they are experiencing the most difficult and challenging times in their lives. When it comes to the legislature, I bring nearly 10 years of experience, two years as Oregon Speaker of the House, I'm into this position because we know how to get things done. Under my tenure as Speaker of the Oregon House, we passed one of the most proactive and largest housing reform bills this state has ever seen. We passed sweeping reforms to help focus people in substance abuse to get treatment first as they are trying to get out of addiction. At the same time, we did this with building reputation of respect, a culture of respect, bringing people together, having transparency in a way that the Oregon House had not seen for in the recent years. Oh, thank you again, Travis. I have a friend in this audience. Thank you. I appreciate it. <laughs> um, with that, what else do I bring um, into this position, Travis? Um, <laughs> You also bring, I also bring a different lens uh, perspective in life. I struggled in life when I was younger. I didn't graduate school on time. I was arrested multiple times before I was 19. I got fired from jobs. But what I'm up here to tell you is that your worst moments in life don't have to define who you are. And that's the type of a journey general we need in this state. With that, what do we want to do in this office? The Attorney General's office, we need to expand our civil enforcement division. The work on behalf of seniors, the work on behalf of kids when they are impacted by predatory lending, when they're impacted by scams, the fly-by-night scams, whether they're timeshare scams, you name it, they come in and out of our communities. We can expand that work. We can expand the work to help build safer communities and work to tackle the drug delivery problems partnering with law enforcement across the state. And then finally, we need to protect Oregon's values. When it comes to the environmental laws that we pass in our legislature, there are attacks nationally to actually roll back the laws here in other our states. So when it comes to setting lower pollution controls in the EPA, those are attacks. We need an attorney general that's gonna stand up to those. Thank, uh, you. thank you very much. <laughs>